Hi everyone! Today we will continue building our Power BI dashboard from scratch. We would also like to see the trends for our expenses. The way they grow, does the cost structure change in timeline? We need to get the answers for these questions. Today we will be building cost structure charts that will give so much information for the business owner. This will be the topic of our today's tutorial. This playlist is devoted to a business owner. Here I'm showing how you can transfer your reporting environment from Excel to Power BI dashboard. We have the following assumptions. Assumption 1. You are a business owner. Assumption 2. Every week or month you have to prepare profit and loss statements for different products, locations, profit centers, etc. You are doing that manually in Excel from scratch, building numerous pivot tables, combining different raw data reports such as revenue report, direct cost report, payroll report, bank statement, vendor cost report, and so on. Assumption 3. You don't have financial or data analyst in your team. We are also assuming that you want to see not only revenues and direct cost picture, you want to see the whole picture of your business containing all types of revenues and all types of expenses. And final assumption, you have just basic knowledge of Microsoft Excel. If that's all about you, then this playlist is yours. Here we're starting from building an Excel tool where you will be simply pasting all your raw data reports. This tool will automatically assign revenue and expense tags to the raw data. Also, this tool will be a library for the cost allocation rules that will be applied to different vendors and other operating costs. The outputs from this tool will be flying to our Power BI dashboard and serve as a data source. Then we will build Power BI dashboard from scratch. Profit and loss statement, slicers and filters, charts and diagrams, and summary tables. All tutorials in this playlist will be very short and comprehensive. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel. Share this video with your friends who have their own business. We can also create Excel decision making tools, models, Power BI dashboards for your business. All the tutorial links you will be able to find in the description of this video. First of all, let's create stack column chart. In y-axis area, let's drag our expenses measures. Direct cost totals. Payroll totals. and operating expenses totals. In x-axis area, we will be dragging year plus month column. Let's give the name to our chart. It will be cost dynamics in dollars. Next, I will be adding data labels to our measures. We 
we can also add totals to our bars. We can adjust the names for our measure specifically for this visual. We can do it very easily by double-clicking left button of the mouse. Now it's time to play with colors for the bars. So this chart will be for cost dynamics in absolute values. Now let's create similar chart but in percentage values to be able to see the structure of cost of our business. To do that, let's create percentage stacked column chart. Let's drag the same cost measures to Y axis area. For X axis area, we will still be using year plus month column. First of all, let's give the name to our chart. Cost structure dynamics in percentages. Now let's make our legend bold. We also need to add data labels to our chart. Don't forget to switch on details, this option will show us percentage structure of our costs.
Now let's play with colors for the bars. As usually, we can rename the expenses measures that we are using in this chart. Now we're done with expenses dynamics charts in percentages. We may also need to add some other chart that will be describing our business. And this will be the topic of our next tutorial. So please like, share and subscribe to our channel. Share this video with your friends who have their own business. Also you can order from scratch building Excel decision making tools, models and Power BI dashboards. All the tutorial links you will be able to find in the description of this video. Thanks for watching, see you next tutorials and bye.